Hello beautiful people and welcome back to the Imperial Balloons channel where we strive to make you feel like royalty during all your special occasions. So today I'm going to be setting up for a birthday party. This was actually a pretty big order. The client had ordered three elements so we have this backdrop that we're setting up right now. And then she also had a white flower wall and a couple of balloon columns that I had to do as well. So this was one of the bigger orders and I had a lot of fun making this one. Her color scheme was actually gold, black, and then she wanted marble as well. And I was contemplating on if I wanted to buy like the Qualitex marble balloons that have like I think gold and white or maybe white and black in them. I'm not sure but I kind of immediately knew that I wanted to DIY this so yeah I did and I think it came out pretty well I am going to be making a video on how I made the marble because I definitely ran into a little bit of an issue when I was doing this marble technique so I'm in the process of troubleshooting right now and trying to figure out what the problem was and what needs to be done differently now if you're interested that video will be posted next Sunday so definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and turn on your post notifications so that you'll be notified when that video gets uploaded. But for now, let's get straight into this setup right here. So yeah, the colors that I use are Sempertex Reflex Gold, Sempertex Fashion Black, and then I use Sempertex Reflex Gold inside Sempertex Crystal Clear to get the marble effect going. I had pre-inflated big chunks of my garland i think it was like two pieces and then i put them together at the venue i also was kind of forced to blow up a lot of clusters of the marble because i was not gonna have time at the venue to put the paint in and then you know do that whole process of making the balloons look like that so i had pre-inflated a bunch of clusters of that and then i was going to inflate any gold and black that i needed on site um, I also opted to put a lot of the eight well not a lot but I opted to put 18 inches in pretty much every single cluster that I had made beforehand and that ended up putting that big black cluster at the top there which I ended up really really liking because actually I was kind of contemplating on trying something different I'm getting kind of bored of these but you know if a client wants something then that's what you should give them and maybe i should start asking them like for a little bit more room creatively so that i can kind of yeah like express some more of my creativeness and my skill into these garlands instead of just doing this basic thing i think that's also why i tried to diy the marble because i just felt like i needed some sort of challenge something that would make this setup a little bit different from what I'm used to. I usually don't put 18 inches at the top of my garland, but the way this looks and kind of goes up, I was really loving it. So definitely let me know what you think about the overall shape in the comment section below. So yeah, as you can see, I've already started to add some more volume to the garland. In this case, I did want to do a little bit extra. I wanted to make it extra full because I just felt like these colors were so chic and it just made me feel like I wanted to do, I just wanted to be extra, if that makes sense. Like that's just the feel that the balloons gave me and the colors gave me. So yeah, I'm going to start adding some volume, also adding some volume in the middle, which I usually don't really do but that's just kind of what the shape asked for and then again because i had some bigger balloons more at the top of the garden which i don't usually have it kind of forced me to add a little bit more volume in those areas as well but in the end i was definitely pleased with the shape so i'm definitely curious to see what you guys think At this point I've already started to add my mini clusters to the garland these were actually three and a half inches and the reason why I did that is because the marbled ones didn't really look good at three inches and I like them to all be the same size so 
if the marbled ones had to be three and a half then the gold and the black also had to be three and a half i didn't mind it and i think i added one little kind of mini garland in black but i didn't want to do too much with that because i felt like the marble it made it look a little bit busy so if i would have had like a mini garland that was just arm all, all marble i don't think that would have looked good so the with the black you could barely see it anyways and i just had like extra quads left so i started adding those is it for this video you guys i definitely love the way that this setup came out like i love the marble i love the gold i love the black i love the shape i love pretty much everything about it this is one of my favorite setups to this point so i hope you guys like it as well if you do feel free to leave it in the comment section below and even if you don't or if you would do something differently or if you have some tips for me on what i can do differently next time definitely feel free to leave it in the comment section and that's it for this video you guys thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe to the channel and leave a like or share some of my videos with your friends and you can find me on all social media platforms at imperialballoons.ac Thank you guys again so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one.